All right, guys, I did a video. I uploaded it early, early this morning. Um, I was pretty upset when I did it. So I'm going to do it. Now I'm going to take you very meticulously through what happened and why I was upset early this morning when I was out there cop watching and why I'm still pretty upset at Ukaipa PD. I'm going to point out two elephants in the room. You may hear, it's kind of quiet, it got quiet now, but you may hear some squawking that, you know, uh, amps up over here because we got a baby cockatiel. It's breakfast time. So it's about seven, eight weeks old now. Just about ready to eat on its own, but you still have to, we still have to give it some of the meal. And uh, you might hear that. The second elephant in the room, yes, I cut myself shaving. Okay, so if somebody's going to comment, and they say, hey, nice blood dot. Yeah, well, I did cut myself shaving. So there you go. But I'm going to take you through why I'm a little perturbed this morning. You, you know, law enforcement really thinks people are stupid. Now, I'm very um, much an observer of not only law enforcement, but people. And I can tell when people are trying to lie or trying to make stuff up because they got to put themselves in a position to be right. So I'm going to go through, I'm going to try to make this as quick as I can. If it's not quick, please listen to the end. I'm going to put a link to the video in the description box below that I uploaded early this morning. I'll put a, a link to that video down so you don't have to go look for it. Although it's the last video I did, but you can just click the link here if you want by clicking that little arrow and it drops down the description box. That's down there. Um, or it is right now. I don't know if YouTube will move it or not. But, because it used to be over here. Now it's here. But, so let me move on. I, I'm sorry. I'm very loquacious. Um, so, I was cop watching last night, you know. And, and they were out there doing traffic stops. And I thought, hey, this would be a good time to document and keep everybody accountable and there was a deputy who was patrolling down around the Calamesa area but in Yukaipa and so I saw him there and I saw him stop at a red light and I pulled into the market there and when I did these three teenagers looked back at the cop they kept looking back at the cop looking back at the cop look Looking back at the cop, stop him, watch him, watch him, you know. And I was like, wow, that's interesting. So I went around the block. And as I came around the block, the deputy had come back up and was in the shop. He pulled into that same shopping mall parking lot and stopped as I was coming down the street. And I saw those same three teenagers booking it around the corner of a store, one of them was doing this, like kind of, you know, trying to duck and run. And they hit a brick wall and all of them went over the brick wall into a mobile home park. And I was like, well, what, they, what the hell are they running from? And I saw the cop car. So I pulled into the shopping mart. The cop call, car is here. Cop caller. The cop car is here. So I pulled in and went around him. And now, is that suspicious? I mean, would somebody who's trying to be a burglar or a prowler drive past a police car it, you got to be the dumbest criminal in the world to do that right i did I went past him real slow went through the shopping mart i went down and i went around the corner to see if those three guys would come out on the other street because i was like what are they running for what you know i didn't are they checking mailboxes are they stealing stuff out of people's yard what are these guys doing running like that at like two in the morning i didn't see them and as I was coming up to the next street, I looked up and I seen the cop coming up the street. Now, I know cop headlights. I know people are going to go, oh, you know cop headlights. I'm pretty good at it. You could ask my wife. I did it in front of High Desert Community Cop Watch and AV Watchmen before. I went, cop. And they were like, where's the cop? Right there. And then cop would come by. I know a cop by the headlights, a cop car. Um, I know it sounds stupid, but no, it's... A cop car has distinct headlights, the Ford Explorers. And if you practice it for a while, you'll get, you too can get good at it, where you'll see 
a cop car go by at night, look at their headlights. Just keep looking at the headlights every time you see a cop car go by. And your eye, your eyes will adjust to where you know that's a cop. And I'm pretty good at it. If I see a cop come up behind me, usually I go, there's a cop, popo alert, and it's a cop. Um, so that said, I knew that was the that same cop that had turned and was coming up behind me. He was flying up that street. I was doing the speed limit. I even looked down because I said, okay, let me make sure I'm going the speed limit because this guy's flying up behind me and I don't want, you know, I don't want to be speeding. I came up to the stop sign. I stop, I look, no cars, and I go. I pull up, the light was red and he wasn't behind me anymore. And as I pulled up, the light turned green. I seen him turn and he floors it. But I'm just coasting. I'm rolling up to this green light. I roll through the green light. And I go and I'm doing about 26 miles an hour and he flies up behind me and lights me up. And I'm like, what the hell is he lighting me up for? I'm just driving. I'm not doing nothing. You know, I thought, oh, he's going to ask me, what are you doing driving around? Now, remember, he's parked here as I turned and went right by him. I looked right at him as I was driving to see if those boys came out on the other street. So he walks up to my car. He goes, yeah, you're driving circles. I said, no, what, what are you talking about? He goes, I pulled you over because you look suspicious. You're driving in circles. I said, suspicious? Is that suspicious a crime? No, but that's the reason I stopped you because you're suspicious. I said, okay, suspicious of what? You're driving around the block. I said, is that suspicion a misdemeanor or a felony? Now, some people go, do you always, guys always say that. A suspicion of misdemeanor or felony. Well, okay, that may be a reason to stop someone, but the reason he stopped me because I looked suspicious driving around the block. That was it. Not that, you know, are you looking to burglarize somebody or, you know, you're just driving around the block. And I told him, now here's, I answer right, I don't know if I answered before or after the suspicious part, but I had my phone up and I was recording. No, because I was trying to, I started recording, but I stopped the recording real quick so I could flip the video so I could hold my phone correctly and see. And I must have tapped that thing twice because I was so nervous. I must have hit it twice so I didn't record it. I'm so pissed off because I swore. I said, this is a good recording. And I didn't, I had a 10 second recording of me going, uh, because I was, I was trying to get it going. Um, at any rate, I, I remember saying to him, I said, yeah, there was some kids that ran from you and they were running through here and they jumped the wall and I went to see if they came out on the other street. He goes, hold on a minute. You saw some people running from me and I'm sitting right here parked. Hello, wifey. Good morning. Look at her. She looks beautiful this morning. So he says, you saw some kids running from me and you saw me parked right there and you didn't tell me. I said, that's not my job. He said, okay, but you're driving around the block. I said, yeah, I just told you. You saw some kids running from me and you didn't think to come tell me. I said, that's not my job, sir. I said, I was just going because I care about the community. I wanted to go over and see if they came out on the other street, see what they were doing. He said, well, that you look very suspicious driving around. I said, I, was suspicion a felony or a misdemeanor? He goes, okay, well, also you didn't stop at the stop sign. Now he's, now he's fishing. Now he's looking for a reason. He's trying to get a reaction out of me. I said, no, I did stop at the stop sign. I stopped, I looked, I went one, two, three, and I went because I saw you back there. Yeah, you saw me back there. Yeah, because you were speeding. Yeah. Now you see, he's building it. He's trying. He didn't pull me over for speeding. He didn't pull me over for um, not stopping at the stop sign. Remember, he pulled me over, he said, because it looked suspicious driving around the block. Well, I told him why I was. And then he got upset because I didn't come over and tell him that there was three kids running and jumped the brick wall. Now it's, well, you didn't stop the stop sign. Yeah, no, I did. Yeah, I did. I stopped. Then one, two, three, I looked and I went. Oh, well, yeah, because I saw your headlights. That's why I stopped. And look, oh, because, yeah, you were speeding. See, this guy's built. He's looking for a reason. I'm going to get to it. There was a female deputy that came up and knocked on my window. And I go, well, I put my window down. She goes, hi. Oh, I know you. I go, yeah, yeah, I know both of you, too. 
Why am I being questioned for suspicion? Is that a misdemeanor or a felony? And he goes, well, you were speeding. I saw you. You were pulling away. I go, no, I wasn't. You were flying up behind me because I was doing the speed limit. That's why you were coming up closer to me. He said, no, I saw you speeding. I said, okay, well, where's the radar? Because I want to see the speed because I knew it would show that I was doing the speed limit. I said, so where's the radar? Well, I don't need radar. That's what he said. Quote, I don't need radar. So I responded with, Oh, um, what's the date of calibration on your eyes? And he thought that was the funniest. <laughs> he thought that was the funniest thing. I said, no, I'm serious. Where's the calibration date? Oh, no, I said, not where's the calibration. I said, what is the date of calibration on your eyes? And he's just laughing. He goes, what are you talking about? Date of calibration on my eyes. I said, well, yeah, you said you don't need radar to see if someone's speeding. So obviously your eyes are calibrated. What's the date of calibration on your eyes? I was pacing you. Now, this guy was three quarters to a mile behind me. As I rolled up to the stop sign, I seen his headlights coming at me. I went around the corner. It's just a short block to the light. As I got to the light, he rolled around the corner really fast and came at me. Because I wasn't speeding. That's why. So he's like, I was pacing you from a mile away, flying up on me. You were pacing me as I'm doing the speed limit. Well, I'm getting closer to you because I'm doing the speed limit. But he's fishing. He says, let me see your driver's license. He just snatches it out of my hand. Let me see your driver's license. I look at her. I go, is this guy crazy? I said, you know what? If I get a citation for speeding, I'm going to make a complaint like you've never heard before. I said, because this is harassment. It's retaliation because I'm filming you and you don't like it because I, those kids jumped the wall and I didn't tell him. Now he's pissed off. She goes, well, you know, the, your, your taillight was out too. Did you know that? I said, my taillights aren't out. She goes, yeah, your taillight. I said, my taillights are not out. Your license plate light is out. Watch this. Also, guys, I don't care if you get my license plate. Here it is. The uh, female deputy said, my, light, my taillights are out. I said, my taillights aren't out. She said, yeah, your taillight's out. I go, no, it's not. She goes, yeah, your license plate light. My license plate light is out. Which one? The left one or the right one? So she said, my license t a plate light is out. Yeah. Which one? Because there's only two. There's one on the left, and there's one on the right. But is there a third one I don't know about? And I even felt up in there for a light bulb. There's not. It's those two. So which one of those was out? Because that video clip you just saw, that was taken right after, well, not right after, but a little bit after they uh, pulled me over. Because they pulled me over. I went up the street. I saw they had pulled somebody else over at Walgreens. So I went and parked real quick. I jumped out of the truck. They see me walking up and they took off. And I said, wow, that, okay. So I got in my truck. I went up. I turned. They had pulled somebody else over at the gas station. So I went to my parked by the best lumber. I got out. She saw me walking up the street with my camera. So they jumped in their police car. Hit their, shut their lights off, and they took off. And as I was walking back down, I looked at my license plate light and my tail lights, and they were all on. My license plate light is out. Which one? The left one or the right one? Like a Christmas tree. So yes, I'm very upset with the Ukaipa Police Department right now because their deputies were caught in a lie. Now, if she's going to lie about the taillights, how the hell can anyone believe this other cop? Who was lying too, by the way. I stopped at the stop sign. I was not exceeding the speed limit. His initial response when I said, why am I pulled over? Well, you look suspicious driving around the block.
Not, I was pacing you and you were going fast. Not, well, you didn't stop at that stop. It was, you were driving around the block. And then I tell him about the three boys. He gets all pissed off. Why didn't you tell me? I was parked right there. Well, it's not my job to tell you that. It's your job to be a cop and be observant. But they were already gone. They were jumped the wall. Boop, goodbye. Why am I going to tell you about some kids that are gone already? Well, I didn't find them. No shit, Sherlock. So both these deputies can't be trusted on the street. You see what I'm saying? You Kaipa PD, we got some more work to do. We got some more work to do. You got some deputies on the street that need some education on integrity. I'm sorry. I hate this. This is one of the hardest videos to make in a way because I really, I don't know. Really started to respect the Ukaipa PD. Now I can't trust them. You can't trust them because they're lying on the street to people. You think that's the first time she used that license plate light thing? You think that's the first time? Probably and probably not. I'm not asking. You think that's the first time? Hmm? And when you pull somebody over, I pulled you over for this. Boop, shoot that down. Oh, um, well, also, also, uh, shoot that down. Well, also, hold on, there's one more thing I pulled you over for. Get the hell out of here, man. Do you think we're all stupid? I know I'm stupid, but does it show in my face? I don't know what you all think. Let me know in the comment section below. Come here, Leo Watch. I'm watching you, Leos. And we're about to turn the heat up on our cameras and we're about to post you all over because people need to watch the police. It's important to watch them.